Hello and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be watching and reacting to Band of Brothers episode 3. In the last episode they got to France. Um, I don't know how many of them survived. I don't think we know yet how many of Easy Company survived the jump and got to um, the place where the man from Captain America is. I'm sorry, I'm still learning all their names. What was his name? I can't remember. I'm sorry. I'll, it will come to me. Um, and then we met... Hall and I fell in love with him only for him to die literally 20 minutes later so I'm still very sour about that um I don't know where they were headed in like at the end of the episode I remember them cooking in the back of the van as well that was very weird um and they destroyed all the guns that, obviously I remember that bit because that was the bit where Hall died um but yeah so I can't remember where the episode exactly left off. Oh, his friend got there. I can't remember his name either. I don't, have they said his name yet? They definitely have, but not enough for me to remember it. Um, but I know that he turned up at, right at the end. So hopefully we'll see a bit more of those two because I do love a set of besties and I'm hoping that we'll see a lot of those two and that neither of them die. Who dis? Yeah, it looks like what's his name? That's what I call all of them. What's his name? What's it doing? Hey, Blythe. Blythe, that's his name. Is that a piece of plane. Is he part of Easy Company? I don't remember him. Trying to find easy. Mm. Join the club. So they're all easy company. Yeah. Is that a World War Two memorial? World War One. <laughs> Is that a World War One memorial? Excited to show up, Lloyd. They found them. I wonder what they did with all of these things that they stole, like the Nazi memorabilia and stuff. Like, are there Americans that have, like, their grandfather's Nazi memorabilia or great-grandfather's that he stole? Got any souvenirs to trade? <laughs> Trading. They're all ticking. Unlike their previous owners. <laughs> Little rat. I wonder if there'll be a point where I don't jump at the gunshots or bombs. Explosions, I guess. Ooh. Please don't go and shake his hand. I feel like that's what he's going to do. Oh, he's going to take the watch. Rank. What? We lost F Company, sir. Again? What do they mean by they lost F Company? Like they're all dead or they can't find them? Who's that? I can hear y'all all the way across the field. <laughs> you have company. That's right. You know, we found F Company. I'll figure out where these yokels are at. Hey, what y'all calling a yokel? What does that mean? Uh, I don't like when they want to. It's okay, he's dead. Oh, oh. Did you find Fox Company? Yes, sir. Oh, F Company, Fox Company. That's Edelweiss. It means he climbed up there to get it. It's supposed to be the mark of a true soldier. Didn't do him any good. So, this is six days after D Day landing, right? Go! Oh. This is very, very. This is making my heart race. Oh, oh God! Fuck it, everybody! Hiding. Where everybody go? I have no idea. I know I shouldn't laugh. It's just the way he said it. No, he's just gonna get shot. Getting killed out there, boys! You got to Put your helmet back on. Oh, 
Well, surely they should be returning fire. Is he alright? Silly question, probably not. Get him. Nice. Have him. Yeah. Oh, the chickens. We gotta take that warehouse. I feel like there should be more of them. Okay, there's a few more coming. I feel like there's just not nearly enough. Oh. Oof. Yeah, saw that coming. Oh, it's just a family. It's not their fault. Leave them, don't hurt them, please. Goodness. Awesome. A what? What have they got? Oh, oh Blythe, is he okay? Has he been shot? Oh! Oh my god! Come on! Oh! That's a very strong man. How is he still alive? Is he alright? You're okay, Lip. Everything's right where it should be. Lipman. You'll hear me repeating their names whenever they're heard. It's just me trying to learn them. Oh my god, I just shat myself. <laughs> Anybody there? Oh, it could be anybody. There could be a family hiding in there. Oh my god. The destruction, man. How has he survived that? Easy, oh my easy. god. There you go. There you go. Oh my god. I can't deal with that. Hang in there, buddy. I can't look it. He's gonna die, isn't he? I'm here and I'm supposed to tell you that we got it clear from here all the way. He doesn't know how to ride a horse, does he? 506 arrived in force and secured all positions south of you. Yes, sir, I'll tell him. Come on, bad boy, let's go. I feel like that was his first time on a horse. Blythe. Oh yeah. Except you can't see. You can't see? So he says. They're just gonna walk on that foot. Oh god. And the winners. What happened? I don't know, sir. But you can't see? I think so. I can't see a thing. How's that happened? I didn't uh, want to let anyone down. Just take it easy. <laughs> He's so cute. I love winters. Is he like by an explosion or something? He doesn't look like he's injured. Thank you, sir. He's looking at him. Uh, I'm okay. Eh? How does that work? We'll be moving out soon. Out of town, Lieutenant. Already? Isn't that the point? <laughs> Keep on pushing. Don't they know we're just getting settled here? <laughs> That's an angry look. I told you, I didn't actually see it. What, Spears shooting the prisoners or the sergeant in his own platoon? Huh? You see, that's why I don't believe he really did it. Oh, you don't believe it? Whoa, you whoa, didn't whoa. see I it? I heard he didn't do it. Oh, God. Always jumping. Practically by himself. Running through MG fire like a maniac. Yeah, that I did see. I mean Smart for him to allow these, like, rumors to continue. He's not going to get messed with, is he? People are going to listen to him. Follow orders. I'm such an embarrassment, you know. 
That was Dexter Fletcher. What's his name? Martin. Was that his name? Ugh. Dirty. Hey, don't blood. What happened to the aid station today? He went blind. That's one of my biggest fears, you know. Going blind or death. No. Thank you, sir. Just a game. Is he drinking, drinking? That's what I was trying to figure out. Ugh, I hate spitting. That seems like something silly. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? That's Talbot. Oh, God, he's just fucking bayoneted him. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. He looked like a crowd. God. What the hell is that? Don't shoot them, please. Why didn't he give the code word? Isn't it flash? Thunder. I'm not victim blaming, but the other one could have done it. I don't want him to get shot. Flash. Thunder. Thunder. Lieutenant Spears, sir. Oh, he is a lieutenant. I got it right. Check out the noise, sir. I just came from there. Everything's under control. I don't. I'm not sure it is Spears. When I woke up, I didn't really try to find my unit. I just kind of stayed put. Fair enough. What's your name, Trevor? Blythe. Blythe, sir. I remembered his one. You know why you hid in that ditch, Blythe? Scared. We're all scared. It's very intense. You hid in that ditch because you think there's still hope. The only hope you have is to accept the fact that you're already dead. Without mercy, without compassion, without remorse. All war depends upon it. How bleak. What a bleak outlook. I guess he's a very good soldier, isn't he? He's sort of proved, well, I don't know, actually. Killing the um, prisoners wasn't my favorite thing that he's done. Who's that? That looked like Winters. Who was that? Well, it wasn't Winters then. Are we going to see Blythe accept that he's already dead and become a soldier like Spears because of his little speech? That'd be me. Oh my god. Well, how the hell are they going to deal with that? Dog and Fox are pulling back. What? I'm always very pleased to see him. Who gave that order? God damn it. Uh, probably the person who spotted the tank. Keep firing! Stay low! How are they supposed to deal with tanks? Fuck it off! Let them have it, boy! I like winters. That's disgusting. Oof. What the heck is that? Oh, they're so out in the open. Oh, what was the point in that? Oh. Holy shit. Oh my god. Yeah, what about the people on the guns? Are they alright? Oh. oh my god. Where are the medics? Oh my god. I can't deal with the str Germans. Oh, Shermans. I thought they said Germans. <laughs> I was like, okay, they need to retreat. Check it out, Shermans! 
about damn time. Did this all happen at the same time? Because otherwise some of them are really slow. Like not observant at all. I wonder how many of them had nightmares just hearing medic, medic, after. That's disgusting. Oh my god, that was vile. Good shot. Christ alive. That was a lot to take in. I was right though, about him. Hey buddy, you okay? No. Looks like you fellas had a heck of a fight. You think? He looks very young. They were all quite young. Just boys, like my haul. <laughs> I'm very upset about that, you know. Is he off to find the man he shot? It's a bit creepy. Why is he doing that? Go back to your platoon. This is a very strange thing to do. Oh, it's Edelweiss. And you didn't climb a mountain for it. That was a very strange little moment. I don't know why you'd go and find the man you shot. Need to take a look at that farmhouse. Who wants to go? No. Don't make eye contact. I'll go. I'll go on, Blythe. Anybody else? Is he going to die after this whole episode being about him? I feel like he is because Hall died and most of that episode was about him, in my opinion, anyway. What exactly are you doing with your reserve shoot? Going to send it to Kitty when we get back to England. Why? Figure it'll make a good wedding dress, you know? <laughs> with rationing and all. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Jeez, Harry, I never would have guessed. What? I'm so sentimental. No, that you think we're gonna make it back to England. <laughs> that was mean. Oh, he's gonna die. It's lucky there's a wheelbarrow there for him to take cover behind. I knew it. Take it easy, Take it easy. Well, he's just not gonna live, is he? They're pulling us off the front line to a field camp north of Utah Beach. Hot food and showers. Nice. All right. Then back to England. Nice. Blythe's not gonna make it, though, is he? I'm starting to think if there's, like, an episode that heavily features someone, they're gonna die at the end. I mean, I get that it was war and lots of them died, but why make me fall in love with the character? still get me all emotionally attached to a character is he alive it is my honor to present you with the order of the purple heart yeah i've seen that film <laughs> what about the one who got shot in the butt does he get one is that him there is he alive that is the one I was trying to buy. How many is that? How is he alive? He got shot in the neck. <laughs> Way up. To. <laughs> oh, back in England. This looks English to me. They did say they were getting sent back to England. So I'll get like a little, nice little episode of peace before I have to see more people die. That'd be nice for me. Idiots. Oh, that was in the intro. The night was filled with dark and cold. It's purple hearts. When Sergeant Talbot <laughs> pulled on his poncho and headed out to check the lines dressed like a crowd. Oh, see the one that got stibby stabbed. 
hearing Floyd, but seeing Jerry. <laughs> oh, God. Well, I'm glad he survived. <laughs> He's a very talented poet. Tad, this is for you. Oh, is he the one that got stibby stabbed? I'm very confused. <laughs> Doesn't know the English money. Like a cup of tea, I've got the water boiling. No, no, thank you. I'm in a hell of a bit of a. <laughs> oh, bless him. Being all polite. You couldn't be a dear help me with a few others, could you? Sergeant Evans, Private Moyer. These are the ones that have died. Collins, Elliot. That was a bit horrible for him. Four years. He only lived four years. I'm surprised he lived that long though. He got shot in the neck. I was not expecting him to live to get back to the hospital, to be honest. So for him to live another four years is honestly a bit mental. I don't know how big Easy Company was for to know in terms of like 65 men how many that is. Um, like what sort of percentage that is. But even so. 65 men and she was just reeling them off to him like are they gonna come back for their pants no felt like a bit insensitive from her so i feel like i've cracked the code on this show if we get a whole episode about a particular person they're probably gonna get injured or die so at least i'm prepared for that and if they don't hmm, lovely surprise for me um so if they knew, do an entire episode about um Winters and his friend, whose name still not mentioned. I'm gonna have to Google it. No, I can't. I can't Google it because it might spoil for me if he dies or not. So I can't even look. Oh, I know what I could do actually. Bear with me. Nixon. There we go. <laughs> I could have done the Captain America man too, but. I feel like his name's Compton. I'm not going to look it up. Um, if they do a whole episode about Winters and Nixon, I'm going to be very upset because I'm going to be very concerned that they're going to die. <laughs> I need just a whole series of them just being besties in the war and not dying and just looking after their ch charges. I feel like that's probably not the correct term, but whatever. The men they're in charge of. The hysterical blindness was insane. I didn't know that was a thing. Um... I want to know how often that happened during the war. That's something I'd be very interested to know, how many people just went blind from, I'm, I'm assuming, shock um, or fear. I don't really have anything else to say. <laughs> uh, let's just wrap up. Thank you for watching. If there was anything you'd like to see me react to in the future, please let me know in the comments down below. As I said at the beginning of the video, my full reaction to this will be on the Patreon, which is linked. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time.